YouTube, what is going on? I hope everyone is doing well. So in today's video, we are going to check out the brand new Extrify M42 gaming mouse. So as you know, if you watch the channel or follow me over on Twitch, etc., you will know that I use the Extrify M4 as my main gaming mouse. So things may just be about to change. So with that said, let's get into this. So let's go ahead and start with the pricing. Right now, you can't actually buy this, but it is set to release very soon and you can pre-order it from Extrify's website. And as expected, it does arrive in many color variations. So let's start by taking a look at what is included in the box. First up, front row, you will of course have your mouse. Then up top, you will see two keycaps, one with the Extrify text and the other with GG. So these do work with RGB, and the colour of the keycaps themselves will depend on the colour of the mouse that you opt for. They do change from box to box. Other items in the box do include an extra set of skates and your usual documentation and a sticker. So the M42 is one of the most versatile ambi mice that I have used to date and we may as well start with one of its main features and that is of course the interchangeable backs. Changing them is super easy, there's a little groove just at the bottom, stick your nail in, pull it upwards and it will come off super simple. But don't worry, this doesn't pop off while you are gaming etc so do not stress about that. And you can opt to have a flatter back or one with a larger hump, so whatever suits your playstyle. Personally, I prefer the larger of the two but obviously that is just preference. If you have access to a 3D printer, you can go onto Extrify's website, grab the file and even make your own backs for these. I definitely want to give this a try, maybe even do one with a logo etc. So I will definitely have a play around with it. If you want to see that, definitely stay tuned to my Twitter or Instagram as I will post over there when I do it. So looks wise, this is a holy mouse and as far as that goes, I'd say it looks pretty nice. We have the same RGB zones that we've seen on the M4 and of course they are all controlled on the mouse itself so no crazy bulky software needed so that is definitely a bonus if you ask me because we all know that we hate RGB software. If we take a look at the underside you will see these two large PTFE feet and compared to the four feet on the M4 these are night and day better. It glides so well and honestly it feels super smooth. Also on the underside we have a top spec 3389 pixel sensor that I can honestly say had zero issues with and the tracking is excellent. And finally on the bottom we have our polling rate switch and the DPI switch and much like the M4 this is colour coded and you can find a chart in the manual to set your DPI. So let's go ahead and talk about the build quality as this thing is absolutely solid. So as you can see, after giving it some completely unnecessary squeezes, there are no creaks, cracks or any of that rubbish. This thing is absolutely solid. When it comes to the buttons, the clicks are also perfect. Have a little listen. Hopefully you could hear that they are nice and crisp and I will tell you that the feedback is very nice on these switches. Placement is also spot on and I find the side buttons super easy to reach and I particularly love the grooves on the left and right click, hopefully you can see them, but they just allow your fingers to lock in place, it's super comfortable and the fact that they start really far back on this mouse and not like pretty near the front like some offer, it makes it really nice to use for long periods of time. Size wise it does feel small and when you look at the dimensions compared to the M4 there may not be a massive difference but let me tell you in hand this definitely feels a lot smaller so just be aware of that and of course it weighs in at 59 grams so you get that nice lightweight feel. The scroll wheel much like the M4 has well defined steps and is super grippy. It's probably one of my favourite scroll wheels on any mouse that I have used. So. I know that it all has been pretty positive so far but there is one slight negative and that is of course the cable. Okay so the cable isn't terrible but it is definitely pretty stiff. If you don't use it on a bungee like me 
you can expect some kinking and dragging etc so just be aware of that as i said a bungee will definitely take away the annoyance of this or you can even go and grab a paracord whenever they become available so i just wanted to point that out just in case you are someone who likes to just run their cable to their pc not use bungees or anything like that so that pretty much rounds this up the extrify m42 is an absolutely solid gaming mouse that packs loads of awesome features and the fact that we have those interchangeable backs will make it pretty easy for anyone just to pick this up and give it a go assuming of course you don't have super extra large hands as it is pretty small as i mentioned so let me know what you think of the m42 down below would you move from the m4 or do you prefer the m4 so as always thank you so much for tuning in stay safe be kind to each other and i will catch you on the next one peace <laughs>